Yo, what's up guys? Uh, Zadie here, aka Ultimate Sniper, and I'm here to tell you guys a really easy tutorial on how to get tools for your Google Chrome browser and how to disable and re-enable them. And uh, basically, they're very helpful, and um, there's a ton of them, so it's pretty important. So in order to get one, all you really need to do is go to uh, the link that I will provide in the description down below and uh, the link is chrome.google.com slash webstore and that slash is a forward slash anyways and uh, when you want to when you come to this page all you really need to do is uh, be logged into your uh, gmail account if you have one I don't know maybe you need one maybe you don't and then uh, just go search and uh, I'm just gonna get my gmail one because I still haven't got that back ever since mine like crashed but uh, uh some comes up and uh, here's the gmail one right here so you basically want to click on that and and uh, you see this loads and uh, basically all you need to do is click add to chrome and then you'll see this uh, little confirm installation thing and you just click install and uh, you see right here uh, it goes to your apps which is, I thought it would be something like this but uh, I guess not I guess I installed something else but um okay sorry for that I actually installed an app didn't really need the app I needed the tool but anyways it's the same concept you just gotta make sure what you're you know what you're downloading and um so yeah and uh, in order to disable and re-enable them all you really need to do is come to it. This is ad blocker, so when you guys are doing this, I very highly suggest you get ad blocker. It blocks out all the ads. It's very helpful, except you know when they're in the video, you can't really stop that. Um, you really just go to disable after you do that, and uh, you see it's gone. But now you, you're probably asking, how the hell am I going to re-enable it now that I don't see it? And uh, to answer that question, all you do is right click on uh, whatever that is, and a uh, little wrench thing. Then you uh, just go to tools and go to extensions. Very easy. And then as you're here, you just click enable. And oh, dang it. Clicked it too many times. And then as you see, it pops back up. So, the reason I did this is because I didn't know what to do and it took me a little uh it took me like 5 minutes of fiddling around. And uh, there's not many videos on how to re-enable stuff. So I thought it would uh, be helpful and uh, save you those ec that extra four minutes or five minutes and like twenty seconds uh, from you know just I don't know. Anyways, <laughs> that was really bad. Um, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, hopefully, more simple tutorials on the way. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Please like the video; it always helps. And uh, peace out.